to print PDFs of PCL files. Now first of all you need to install GhostScript. Uh, in the help file there's a link to it. You can search for it on Google. Um, it's the GhostScript installer and in this case I'm going to install 8.51 which is an older version. But the new version will work fine as well. Uh, I'm going to download it now. See it's down. And then once it's downloaded, you install it. Default location is GS. Yes, I'm going to copy that location. And that's installed. Now, we're going to the setup. What you do is add a file, PDF file to set it up. Press and set up. In this case, I want to enable command line scripting. Now, I basically want this down here. So, this is my location. You can actually navigate to it here in Explorer. It's actually under x86 in this case. So change that to x86. Everything's there set up. Now you can test it out. You don't need dot setting. That will pick it up and click print a little problem there now I know what's missing and it's the um, command at the end and then click print you can see it's processing file now it should print it out as a PCL file on the printer uh, if you want to use that setting in future for every PDF, what you do is copy processing parameters clipboard, yes, PDF processing, right mouse, paste. So that's all set up now. So I can add any new file, scroll across, you can see this process set there, and then click print. If you need to change any print settings, if you go on the GhostScript website, you can change how it processes the PDF files because in here you can see the parameters that it's passing to GhostScript to actually create the PCL file from the PDF. And you can change that to how you want it. Uh, give it a try.